Actually, it was funny because I had to kind of, I had to kind of stop myself from talking then because it was about to turn into sexual innuendo. Yeah, but we, there should be some form of, ref, how would you put it? I mean, yeah, it's okay to have some sexual innuendo once in a while, but don't we have it all the time? I mean. People have already mistaken us for a dating service already. Yes, we were formerly known as the Gold Coast Fighting Game Community and Dating Service at one point during a tournament. Now, I'll just swap it back to full screen. You done goofed it there, Dajon. Oh! Yep. Stopping that super. Yeah, I totally get that. Actually, it was really funny, like, for some reason, I get told by my various relatives that I should have something to do with them, except they have nothing to do with me outside, like, outside of family gatherings, so it's like, why am I caring? Yeah, yeah, we're just doing footage at the moment. I've got it back in full screen. Yes. Yes, I have the names. Come on. Do you now? Thank you very much for that slight bit of credit I get for actually knowing what I'm doing. Unless you're doing with this, in which you should be getting credit, all of, you should be getting all of the credit. Not getting scummed. Thank God, there's a Seven Eleven just down the road. Oh, we do. Well, it actually. Well, what are you talking about? It is down the road. It's called Pacific Fair. It is just down the road from us. How much is the glass bottle of Coke, anyway? Jesus Christ. Oh God, dear God, I must try some, I must try some of that Doritos roulette. Yeah, well I, was, well I just ate a, well I just ate a Angry Whopper earlier, and that was just covered in how it is. I have a feeling my brother did it just to, just to show how displeased it was at my presence, at his work. Actually, the other night I had, um, what was it? The, uh, um, spicy chicken burro burrito from Guzman Y Gomez. Holy shit, that was hot. Because it's got the habanero sauce with it. 
That was that was hot. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you can you can actually you can get jalapenos there as well, like because what ha what they do it what they do with Guzman is they actually do have a separate. They've got what they call a sauce bar where you can get extra sauce. There's there's a thing of jalapeno chopped up jalapenos there. They if you want, you just put some, get a couple of containers of that, and just sprinkle it onto your burrito at any point. Oh! Damn. Intagro equalizes it. Just thank God we're not keeping score because I've got a feeling it would just. Yeah. What? God damn it. Okay, I just put it back in the main screen at the moment. Oh damn. Hey! Seymour has a round. Let's hope a miracle can occur yet again. Much froze. <laughs> Damn it, Zemo, you're supposed to say such something. And wow. That's better. Maybe a shitty meme, but people still laugh at it for some reason. Hey, why the hell were you just... You just dissed it earlier. <laughs> yes. Those. Hey, you were the one who said such bad meme. Oh no, no, no! Oh, there was a funny picture today with um, Tony Abbott in one of those balloon helm balloon hats. Take a guess what was on said balloon hat. Give you a hint. Actually, no, Sieg Double Zero. This is not Skull Girls. This is Yata Garasu. Attack on Cataclysm. Yeah. Attack on Cataclysm. What? Oh, 
All right, Jim. Okay, Yatagarasu is a game that was um, kickstarted by three former SNK employees. And it was recently released on Steam. You can currently get it for $15. I've but that's, that's, is that Australian or US? Okay, so $15 US. Which will probably translate to, what, 20 bucks. No, no, no. It's, that wasn't get hit. That was getting wrecked there.